Hi guys, it's Elizabeth Pfeiffer from ElizabethPfeiffer.com and today's question comes from our Soulful Shift Kickers group on Facebook and it's about mindset, how to counteract and deal with mindset beliefs. And so mindset is my topic of conversation um, and, and it's really about thoughts, feelings, and beliefs about how you perceive particular situations and um, relationships. So when you have issues with your mindset, you have what we call a set point or a default point is what I should say. So it's kind of like, you know, things are going good, things are going good, these are going good, and then you run into something and it's like, whoosh, it takes you right back to your set point, your default point. And for a lot of people, that set point is the vibration of the victim. Everything's happening to us. They take absolutely no responsibility for, for anything. It's all happening to you. There's nothing um, that you're thinking, feeling, or believing that would have caused that. Um, and that's not true. That's just your that's just your default point. Your default point goes straight back to victim. So anytime um you're moving in this direction and you hit that wall, you automatically will always go back to that default point. So the idea behind mindset is changing that default point, changing that vibration, those perceptions of victim and transferring them or transforming them into more empowered ways of thinking, feeling, and believing. And we do this with um, a couple of interventions and a lot of people have a lot of different tools. I happen to use a combination of what I call above work and below work. We use a lot of energy healing and pulling out of belief systems from a soul level. And then we do mindset work here down on the earth plane to kind of combine the two so that they are a nice little smooth thing. So when you have a mindset issue, when you're working on resetting your default point, there are a couple of things that need to go with this. Number one, excuse me, number one, it can take up to about 21 to 30 days to change your reset point, okay? And that is with daily conscious um, counteractions in changing your vibration. Now, can it go faster if you use mindset work or energy work with it? Yeah, it can go a little faster. So it depends on how you want to do it. The second piece is you can, when you, when you find yourself going, back to your default point, you you have to recognize that you're doing it. That's step two, is having the awareness and the recognition that you have a de uh, default point or set point, um, what it sounds like to you, and then to be aware that you're in it. And once you're in it, you can then intervene. You can do a counteraction plan, which is changing your thoughts, feelings, and beliefs and refocusing your energy in a different direction. Or two, you can use some um, EFT techniques to kind of tap out that heavy, dense energy of belief. Um, EFT stands for emotional freedom technique. It's that tapping exercise. Um, you can do energy work um, and you can do what I call belief pulling. And when we look at belief pulling, we look at where the beliefs are, where they stem from, where they came from. Are they yours? Are they your parents? Do you belong to your ancestors? And then we pull them energetically, which changes the way you think, feel, and believe. Um, now understand this, mindset work is a practice. It doesn't happen overnight. And for those of you who've read um, any of Abraham's books, ask and ask and you shall receive or something, ask and receive, I can't even remember, or um, getting into the vortex, you'll notice that they have exercises there to keep refocusing, refocus, refocus, refocus. And it is a practice. There are people who are practicing on changing that default point for months. Sometimes it takes them years, depending upon how embedded those energies are. And so when you're talking about mindset work and you're talking about changing that default pattern and counteracting and changing your energy and the focus and the way you perceive, um, it can only happen with practice. Now, we run... Um, several programs that do practice work 
So we have the practice work, we do the energy work, and then we do the belief pulling because I'm very impatient and I like to have things done as quickly as possible, if we're going to be honest. So I like to, I like to hit it and I like to hit it hard and get those, get that stuff out of there because that's ultimately what I believe, um, you want. I think that's ultimately what I want. And I think that's really what most people want. Um, but it does take an, uh, um, a vibration of being responsible for that set fall, that default set point. Oh, just combine those words together. <laughs> so, you know, being aware that you have it, being aware of what it sounds like, and then taking responsibility for it and saying, okay, that's what it, whatever it is. And then moving your attention and your direction away from the negativity Okay, it's kind of like getting on the train. So if you're on the train and you're headed toward the default point, I have an example here, right? And you're headed toward your default, woo woo. <laughs> okay, you have a choice now. You can turn your train around and go in another direction or you can take it all the way down to Victimville as far as you wanna go. But I will tell you that if you keep that train on that track, Everything that you're experiencing only gets worse and it snowballs to the point where you have to really dig yourself out of a huge hole. So if you get to that point, you intervene with any counteractions or EFT or energy work, then you're actually taking the train, turning it around on the tracks and start heading in the opposite direction. Keep doing that over and over for about 21 to 30 days. I'm hearing for some people three months and that de default set point will change so it's a matter of taking responsibility for it and then doing the work so thank you for that question um, if you found it helpful please leave us some comments below and let us know and if you think it would be helpful for anyone else please feel free to share in your social networks thanks so much have a great day